Hello and welcome back guys to another video here on the Proto Squad. Today we are going to be playing some Skyrim. So, this isn't going to be a vanilla playthrough. I've already installed a few mods. Nothing game breaking. I'm not going to be cheating. or I mean, technically I guess we're cheating. But this is the... Um, most of the mods that I chose were just for um, quality of life improvements. We'll up the graphics a bit. You know, it's, it is an older game. Um... But the main one, which is the one you're seeing now, is start a different life. So we're still technically the Dragonborn. We're just not going to go through that opening vanilla say, oh, um, opening scene. Yeah, that's what I want it. Um, yeah, this way we pick our character here. I'm not going to do any like big changes. I'm just going to pick a race and class and all that. And then uh, we'll just get into it from there. And you'll see what's going to happen. If you don't know already, um, I do like orcs, but I'm feeling like you know, stealth and magic skills. Stealth, I like the stealth, but I think I want to be a kitty. Like excellent thieves, that does sound fun. Normally, I always play as a orc, but. We're going to do something a little bit different. We're going to go with the Khajiit this time. Okay. Uh, let's see. Do I want to be, be a guy? We're just going to go with like one of the presets. Ooh, that one looks like a tiger. Okay, skin tone. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. Perfect. Beautiful. 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 Alrighty. So, we just have to name... Finish a name, yeah. Seeing we look like a tiger, we are going to be Tony. Tony the Tiger. I know, super original. Alright, so in this one, we just wake up in a dungeon. Um, and pretty much we're left here to rot. However, Our Lady Mara... And choose where your new life shall begin. Is going to give us the second chance. So we can be... We arrived aboard a ship. Um, I own property in one of the holds. That's probably the best one to go with because you automatically start with a house. But I don't think we're going to do that. I'm a new member of a guild. I'm a patron at a local inn. Soldier in the army. That's the vanilla one there. Got, cross, got, car, ah, got caught crossing the border. Um, I want to escape the cell. I'm an outlaw in the wilds. I'm a vigilant of Stendar. Camping in the woods. Shipwrecked on the coast. I'm a vampire in a secluded lair. I'm a necromancer's... Uh, I'm a necromancer in a secret location. A warlock's thrall. Attacked and left for dead. I am a Khajiit caravan guard. Well, I mean, that would make sense, considering we are Khajiit. Mm. But I kind of like the attacked and left for dead one, because then, because like the whole point of games like this is to like role play it, you know, like oh I'm this character. So if we do that, our characters like theme can be like oh we're gonna hunt down bandits, you know, and just like kind of be like a mercenary type. I kind of like that. The light of hope shines even for you. Don't give up. Alrighty. So then all we do is come right over here to the bed. And boom. We are in it now. But yeah, this is one of my all-time favorite games. Like, ever. I have my own Thum tattooed on my arm. Oh boy, where did we wake up? Uh... Yeah, this is nice. It, it could start you in really random places, like places that you're not really meant to be. Oh, you don't have anything, do you? Well, crap. Okay. So, um, yeah. I wanted to play this for the channel because, like, back in the day, like, you couldn't go to a YouTube channel and see, it would, like, not see this game. It was everywhere. And you don't see it anymore. 
Like everything's Fortnite, everything's Call of Duty, everything's you know all these other games. Like, and that's cool. I have nothing against those types of games. I play Call of Duty on my own free time. Oh, oh no. Oh no 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 no. We are in trouble, guys. We are not even in Skyrim. Oh, we are. Oh my God. This is um not more. Uh, this isn't. Is this Morrowind? Crap. Where am I? Uh oh. Oh no. This is going to be difficult. We have to get over here to this dock. Oh boy. This is a very. This is like meant for after you beat the game, like the regular game. This is like DLC content here. Oh no. Oh no, no, no. Oh. I, I have no weapons. I have no um, stats, really. Like, this is a newborn character. Ah. Uh, well, let's just see. Hopefully we can make it. Oh my god. I didn't expect this. Oh, I hear something. I don't know what I hear. Alright, whatever. We're gonna try and... Oh, it's one of those uh, ash grasshopper things. Oh my god. Oh, this is great. I really didn't expect it. This has only ever happened to me once. When I picked... I was stranded at shore. But you know what? I'm going to harvest as much stuff as I can because I'm gonna need money once we get somewhere uh, none of this stuff is gonna sell for a lot oh no what is this nope they are not friendly Shh, we're sneaking ah ah what a way to start this series I mean, I'm not complaining, like, this is an interesting start, at least. Let's see. No, I don't want to wait. I want to see my map. Um, I'm kind of going in the right way. No, I'm not. I'm going in the complete way. Is that where I need to go? Oh, my God. I don't even know where I need to go, to be honest with you. Oh, do I need to be over here? Need oh, oh, okay. No, I am going the right way. Okay, yeah, we need. we do need to be over here. This is something else. Okay, thank God my accident was helpful. Uh-oh. I'm detected. What detects me? Who sees me? Someone or... S oh, no. Run, run, run. Oh, I have no stamina. Ow, ow, ow. I'm on fire. Guys, this isn't good. We're going to die. I can't take hits. Oh my god, I'm out of stamina. Please don't be following me. Okay, they're following me a little bit, but they're falling back. I have no potions. I have absolutely nothing. Okay, but this is the town here, right? Right, okay. Let's see if I can make my way down without killing myself. Oh, I'm stuck? Oh no. Okay, thank god. Okay, we made it to the town, so we're safe ish here. Right, yeah, we should be safe here. Whew, my god. That could have been bad. I don't know why I keep hearing the grasshopper cricket things. Um. I know there's going to be a dude fighting some people over here. I spent m way too much time on this game back in the day, so... Uh, I know I have no chance of fighting these guys. Uh, I could have swore he had men with him. I was going to try and steal their armor. That would have been a very good start. Uh, 
this is not. So I think I need a. All right, let me go talk to the captain because honestly, there's nothing for us to do here right now. We're way too low of a level. Um, yeah, that kind of sucked, but oh well, an adventure. We didn't die. So that's a plus. Oh no, the music, I forgot. I had to, oh no, well, I really hope you guys can hear me. Uh, settings. Uh, music. Okay, the music wasn't too high, so that's a plus. But hopefully nothing else is too loud. Um, I'm just gonna lower everything a bit. Okay, there we go. I forgot it wouldn't let me do that in the main settings. I had to wait until the game end. I completely forgot. So I apologize. So who's the captain? I don't remember which one's the captain. Captain Gallon does the business around here. I'm just a ship. Uh Captain? Oh Captain, my Captain, where are you, my Captain? Oh no, where's the captain? Where, where? Northern maiden, Making passage to oh, where was you? I'd like passage back to Skyrim. So, no, we have to scrounge up 250 gold. I don't think I have any items. Uh, oh, I started with some green apples. And. Oh, that's just for fixing bugs to come up with app or come with the mods. Um, just gonna steal as, but as much of this stuff as I can. I'm not gonna actually go and steal because I'm not trying to get arrested because that's a no way now. And because we've never been in the actual. Skyrim area, we have no places to just fast travel to, so woo us. Uh, excuse me, good sir. Uh, what have you got for sale? I don't care what you got for sale. You have quite a bit of money, though. Oh, he didn't even give me money for that. Oh, they're not even worth anything. None of that stuff is worth anything. If, if. Okay. Wait, no. Oh, I probably shouldn't have sold him that book. Wow. If you need any supplies, you know where to find them. Right, I'm gonna try going into the mine. Maybe get lucky in there. I don't remember what's in the mine. I know it's part of a story, but it's been a while since I did this stuff. I don't even know if there's anything I can actually get from in the mine, because I'm pretty sure it's locked up. Vicious, last time you explored the mine, you almost fell to your death. I'm not spending the rest of my days as a widow. And I'm telling you that I'll do whatever it takes to find my great-grandfather's on Earth. He's down here. I can feel it. Yep, yep, he yep. He's down here. There may be nothing left to find. Just let me go, woman. Precious, you're an obstinate old fool, and you're going to get yourself killed. Yeah, that, that really sucks. You know, you gotta be careful. Ooh, a pickaxe. I could use that. Um. Yeah, as long as the items say take and not steal. Then we could take them. Uh, Who in the blazes are you? Can't you see I'm busy? Uh, busy doing what? what did I tell you, I don't even know who you are. Perhaps I could help. It's dangerous here for an old man. Most of the folks around here, and they'd agree with you. But mark my words, these mines hold a secret that could put Raven Rock back on the map. What sort of 
East Empire Company swept under the rug two centuries ago. It killed my great-grandfather and left Ravenrock with a worthless, expensive mind. Uh, who's your great-grandfather? And I'm going to put the subtitles on for you right after this conversation, so I do apologize about that. Gracian Kyrelia. He spent his entire life exploring ancient ruins of Frostamia. He died. His very mind was open to 200 years ago. How did he die? The East Empire Company called it a terrible accident, claiming that he was lost in a rock fall. But I know better. What's your proof? My wife and I were cleaning out our home. Came across some of my great grandfather's things locked in an old chest. I found an unsent letter he'd written to the East Empire Company and a key. Oh, uh, what did the letter say? It describes a discovery that was made in the mine by some of the diggers. They wanted Gracian to take a closer look. The East Empire Company must have felt it was of great value as they locked that section of the mine off from everyone else. The key is to the lock section? It is. Well, I assume it is. I haven't been able to find the entrance. Mm. I still think you're crazy. <laughs> uh, I, I won't be that mean to him. I admit, that does sound suspicious. Finally, someone who believes me. I'm telling you. Something that the East Empire Company wanted to hide from everyone. Why are you telling me all of this? Look, my wife nags that I'm too old to go traipsing around these mines chasing my story. Time's my enemy. She caught up with me before I could find the answers that I'm looking for. So you need my help. I want to know what happened to Gracian and what the East Empire Company is keeping from all of us. Any idea where to store? Journal of notes about his discoveries. If you can find his remains, I'm hoping it will help. Here's everything I have: the letter, the key. Please do this for me, so I can finally regain the respect that I've lost. Sure. Are you sure? Grayton's death wasn't an accident. Uh, sure, we'll ask him that. I know I don't have much to go on. I have that unsent letter, and that's really it. But I also have a miner's instinct that's run in my family from before Gratian was even born. Gratian. I may sound like a crazy old man to you, but I'm telling you, the tunnels here are solid. They would never collapse like that. Uh, why were you arguing with Afia? He thinks that old age has ever I'm seeing things when there's nothing to be seen. I realize she cares about me, but she has to understand that I can't rest until I find out what happened to Gratian. What if she's right and I don't find anything? Then I'll settle down peacefully and never set foot in this mine again. I've been waiting for this moment for a long time, even before I discovered Gratian's old things. I just hope both of you don't mistake my enthusiasm for insanity. No. Alright, so we have got our first mission. I don't know if this is going to be... Because I, I really don't remember this part that well. Um, like this section of the game at all. Wait, 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 what's that? What's that now? Uh, takes an expert lockpick or lockpicking seal, uh, which we are obviously are not. So I'm actually going to go ahead and leave this episode here. Um, I'm not sure if we're going to be able to even do this mission, but I'm kind of just hoping to find some, maybe some ore or something of value down here. That way we could just sell it and get out of Skyrim or get out of, uh, Oh my god, this isn't more. It's part of Morrowind, but it's a different name. I'm sorry, I, I can't think of it right now. Wait, does it tell me? 
Oh, hold on. Before I even do that, settings, display. Is it under display or would that be under? Dialogue subtitles. There we go. Okay, cool. General subtitles, sure. All right, so we have the subtitles activated for the next time we talk to someone that way in case you can't hear them or whatever. I'm not going down there yet. Nope, because then we're going to keep going. Alrighty, so yeah. I guess we'll see what happens next time. Um, hopefully we can raise money to get back to Skyrim. Raven Rock. Okay, I need to go to world map. Uh, yeah, it doesn't really tell me the name of the island I'm on. I don't remember. I know it's part of Morrowind, but anyways. Alrighty, I got sidetracked again. Sorry. But if you are enjoying this, go ahead and leave a like, a comment, maybe subscribe, share with your friends. And as always, I will see you guys tomorrow. Later.